What's your name? No. And uh, where are you? Where are you from? I'm from Bodega Bay. You come down here to Porto a lot? Yeah, every year. And uh, how long have you been surfing? I uh, started surfing when I was 18, so 29, 11 years. And you surf uh, contests at all? Uh, I surfed a couple contests here, uh, but that's it. And what about traveling? I like traveling. Where? What other countries have you been to? Uh, Hawaii, Maui, Kauai, Oahu, and Chile, Peru, Mexico, France, Spain, Canary Islands, Tahiti, Indonesia, Western Australia. That's it so far. That's it. And how does this wave here in Puerto compare to those waves? I love Puerto. Uh, at home, our waves are all beach break, and uh, Puerto's just like a bigger, more intense version of the same thing. So I love Puerto. It's my second home. What have you seen at uh, other beaches that you'd like to see here in Puerto? Um, other beaches are cleaner, but uh, and there's not so much development on the beach here. There's too much development on the beach, and I think eventually it's going to have an impact on the sandbars. How long have you been coming down to Puerto? Uh, I came for the first time in '94. And uh, has it, has the wave here changed much since then, or? Uh, Sometimes it's uh, it's hollow and closing out, and sometimes it's hollow and perfect. Um, could go either way. When it's closing out, it's not as crowded. No, I think it's been good the whole time. I think it's still good. Are you sponsored right now? No, no sponsors. Why is it hard to get sponsorship? Uh, there's not a lot of uh, surf industry going on up where I'm from. So, yeah, pretty low key. You would like to be sponsored? Yeah, I'll take a sponsorship, <laughs> for sure. What about seeing more of Puerto on, in the magazines and TV? Uh, Puerto is pretty, I don't know, it was overexposed for a while, and now I don't, I think there's still a lot of exposure of Puerto. It's such a photogenic place. Every morning the sun is shining and it's hollow, so it makes for great photos. What else is there to do here besides surf? Um, it's really a good place to hang in a hammock and <laughs> make food, meet new friends, uh, just uh, read books, be Relax. creative. It's a great place to be creative in the afternoon. Any uh, messages or advice for somebody wanting to come down here and surf? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Bring a board that's thick. Uh, don't bring like a really short, chippy board because they don't work and they don't. You can't get into the good waves. What about uh, you? Have any worst experience that you want to? Tell about any bad wipeouts? Uh, no, I love my wipeouts here in Puerto, but uh, the beautiful thing is it's a sand bottom, so they're they're not too bad. Only if you got stuck in a rip, but I've been lucky enough to avoid them. All right, there we have Noel, the best local by choice tube rider around. <laughs> See ya.